Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai Ba'ashem Akarkadash. Shalom to the uh, elders. Wa Akem wa Akwaf, and I say Shalom. In the heavenly Father, true name is Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Ba'ashem, in the name of Hamashiach Kaushai. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the Lashwan Kadash, the whole tongue. And I say Barak to the uh, elders. Wa Akem wa Akwaf once more. And this is a uh, quick sit down lesson of uh, Joel 2 and verse 1. And this is uh, the prophet Joel 2 and verse 1. Blow ye the trumpet in Zion to Zion, which is the Israelites is doing modern day times just like they did in ancient times. Blow ye the trumpet in Zion, sound the alarm on my holy mountain. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble. For the day of the Lord Yahweh cometh, for it is nigh at hand. Right, because the Heavenly Father is coming back with fire, like it says in Malachi, the fourth chapter, Isaiah 66, verse 15 through verse 16. So the Israelites, measuring the time diligently in itself, sound the alarm, blowing the trumpet, occupying the prophecies, and measuring the time diligently in itself. As we're getting closer and closer to the day of the Lord, Yahweh thy power. You no, know, because he's going to come back with fire. And that's why he's setting up the uh, Armageddon, Armor God 1. Second world pass, behold, third world coming quicker. You know, just like this is taking times in, in Joel's times, in ancient times. Now we see this in modern day times as well, too, because the scripture says uh, there's no new thing under the sun, you know. And that's why you see in the Israelites from ancient times, sound the alarm, blowing the trumpet, you know. Um, and that's taking place ancient, in, from ancient times to modern day times. So once again, you know, there's no new thing under the sun. This is other prophet Joel 2 and verse 1. Blow ye the trumpet in Zion, sound the alarm in my holy mountain. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble, for the day of the Lord Yahweh cometh for is nigh at hand. Right, so the day of the Lord Yahweh is nigh at hand. From ancient times now into modern day times, so there's no new thing under the sun. Because keep this in mind, you know, the Heavenly Father, he's the ancient of days. He doesn't change, he, he remains the same, you know. So he's definitely coming back with fire, just like he uh, did in uh, ancient Sodom and Gomorrah, because this is a modern day Sodom and Gomorrah. This is a modern day Babylon. This is a modern day Tower of Babel. This is a modern day Egypt. Modern days of Noah. Modern days of Lot. So there's no new thing in the sun. So with that, this was just a quick sit down lesson of uh, Joel 2 and verse 1. I just wanted to bring out as a quick sit down lesson. So hopefully this uh, lesson was edifying of Joel 2 and verse 1. And with that, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to, to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem Kadash. And the heavenly Father, the true name is Yahweh, and his unbegotten son, Bahashem, in the name of Hamashiach, Havashai. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the Lashwan Kadash, the whole tongue. And I say Barakatham to the elders, Wa'akiyam, Wa'akwaf. Until next time, I will say Shalom.